Hello, today I'm here with the third video for this week and it's time for the third palette with Kaleidos and this is the Astro Pink that is the Futurism Free and if you didn't know, the palette looks like this I think that a lot of people really like this palette I do as well, it's not my favorite palette but like this duochrome up here I'm gonna see if I can show you so bad at this maybe in the mirror maybe there it is like a blue and purple duo chrome it's just amazing and i won't use this today i actually don't think that i will do a like a complicated look today either I don't know why, but I just feel like I want to do some easy looks. So I'm going to prime my eyes and then we just get started. Do a sitting a little bit. Okay. So I am going in with uh, this shade in my crease. And then I think I just go and slap the lighter like... Did I have black on my finger? How the hell? Put my finger in the black shade. Okay, so I will go in with that matte, a little bit darker, and I will take this in my crease. And I, I do like this palette, but I think I am missing like something with it. I don't know what though, but it's just something about it. I really love though it's a black in it, even though it's a black in the sci-fi green as well. But Kaleidos, they do amazing black shadows. And I really like these two shades that look like maybe a little bit boring. I like them, but I think in a six pan palette you don't need both of them. But like it is what it is. So I think something just like this for my crease. Then I will go in with this shimmery pink. Just slap it on my whole lid. And I think this is just an amazing shimmer. But it feels a little bit like people forget about this just because the duochrome in this is so freaking cool. And I have done a look where I did take the black shade and then put the duochrome over and that looks really really amazing. Okay, so I'm trying to blend this a little bit up in my crease as well. And I think that I will, might go in with the brush that I had in my crease. Maybe I should just have slapped the duochrome all over my eyes. But I was like, okay, I think I don't want to use the duochrome. But you know what? I think I'm changing my mind. As of right now, it is a little bit like flaky up in my crease, but I think I like it. I will though go in with my crease brush, just dip a little bit in the color, tap it off and then go over. Just like in my crease. And then... I think I will take the duochrome and just put it on like my outer corner. And I have no idea how this will look and I will try to take the same brush but now it's full with like glare specks if I do like this. This is my way of speed cleaning things. And I'm putting it... Maybe it doesn't work that good with this brush, I don't know. It might not. Because this is really the best with a glitter primer or like spraying it. Ok, 
I think this gives like a little cool of an effect. We just need to stamp it on like this. Maybe I don't have the best brush for this, I don't know. Maybe it would be real good to use my finger. But I don't really like to use my fingers. But I think that this is looking pretty cool. It is like a little bit grey. Out here. Do you know what I... I'm liking this. I hope that you can see the difference between the eyes. And one thing with this palette, I usually don't think Kaleidos shade stains, but this one this do stain it's nothing like crazy crazy much but it do stain okay i i really like this i really do so i will take away the fallouts i fix my base and then i come back and i don't think i want to I have no idea what I want to do with my under eyes, but I will fix the rest of my face and then I come back. So time for the under eyes and I will start with my crease color and we will see how I will do after that because right now I have not like a single clue. Maybe this is going to be enough, I don't know. And just let the... Uh, um, let it speak for itself. Okay, I might actually think I will... So, where was I? I think I will go in with the duochrome. Like, take it... Take it just, like, out here. This is good. Like, now I don't even care if it will a little bit on my face or oh, maybe <laughs> maybe I shouldn't say that like this so I will put on something in my waterline a lippy and a mascara so I will fix that and then I come back so this is the finished look for my waterline I used cry baby from Colourpop on my lips I used the combo of these two from Kaleidos I almost said Colourpop it's my favorite lip tonic this is in immersion and then a lucid lip in fantasize i just wanted something like a little bit shimmery on my lips as well so this is my third look with the astro a pink palette it feels like i say the same thing in every video because i really like this one as well i if you didn't saw that when I showed you my close-up, um, I don't know if you can see, but like this shade for me has leaked a little bit. I know that has happened to others as well. And now I have half of a cat in here. Um, the shade still looks uh, on the eyes at as it used to. It doesn't smell, it perform as, as it is bad. What? It performs still as it always have. So I still use it. You have to do like your own judgment, but it still works like it always have. So yeah, this is my look with the Astro Pink. The next palette I think it is VR Neon. I'm pretty sure. And do you hear Astrid? I think I have to let her in so soon. What's up with my language? But yeah, I really hope you like this video. And if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do. And I really, really hope that you will stay with me this whole week to see all my 
Kaleidos, my Kaleidos week. Yeah. And if you didn't know, I am right now or soon, I will be having a Q&A here on my channel. So if you have any questions for me, it can be about anything. I will, I have a post on my community tab where you can ask questions or you can ask them down here and I will answer like almost everything, maybe not like two personal things, but you can ask me things about my life, makeup, cats, I don't know, whatever you want. And I will answer what I feel comfortable with. So yeah, I really hope you like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. Do I say that? I don't know. But yeah, I really hope you like this video and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!